three hours early and there's a couple of extra checks for like forms and stuff um but i might share all of that at the end so you guys know what you need to do if you're gonna go away um but there's no extra testing or anything like that at the moment because menorca has turned green and to enter spain you don't need any extra testing so that's really good news for us you excited lou okay lou's not gonna speak apparently oh, sorry, <laughs> is your name not louis yeah, well, I wasn't really listening. I okay. Just so down. That's what you're excited. I am excited. Though. Yeah. Good Our to get first. Out of weather. Yeah, it's raining at the moment, so you might be able to hear the windscreen wipers. I don't know how good the sound's going to be. Um. So yeah, it's our first holiday with Oscar, and it's our first flight in like two and a bit years. I think maybe even longer because we didn't fly when I was pregnant. So, and then Oscar's in the back. <gasps> She's focusing. Uh, can you tell that I'm not very good at this? There we go. Are you going on holiday? Gonna meet granddad for the first time. How exciting. Gonna swim in the sea and meet my cousins and my auntie. So I'm just going to chat through the footage that we shot on holiday. So he was really good on the plane. You can see there that I've got the iPad ready, bottle ready so that his ears don't pop. But he was actually really content, really happy. And we planned it so that I knew he would be sleepy on the plane. He did fight it a little bit here, you can see. It was just so noisy. Um, so he sat with us for a bit. Somebody actually moved seats so he could sit in between until I was able to get him to fall asleep. And then he stayed asleep through the landing. Then this is my cousin's villa. He's actually um, just living there and looking after it for somebody. So we went there most mornings. And Oscar's only been in like a pool once and that was like an alleged centre local to us. So this is the first time like actually properly paddling and he wasn't really sure about it to begin with. So you can see he's not, <laughs> not really sure, but by the end of the holiday, he was loving it. more obsessed with the dog than the water <laughs> and you have to excuse the footage the camera's a bit shaky and this is obviously the first like vlog that we've done so still learning Then this is my dad walking next to me and we went for quite a few lunches with dad. This is one of our favourite places. So we've been coming here since I was tiny. Got some calamari, some baby squid. And then this is one of the villas that you can rent through my dad. So this is the pool that we went to every day because the villa we actually rented didn't have a pool. Then this is one of our favourite restaurants called Bamboo. It's quite new. It's like Asian fusion, me just doing my Instagram bit, and Oscar at dinner. He's a bit tired there. Um, the plan was to nap him in the push chairs, but it didn't really work out that way at every meal. So you can see I'm pushing in there, but he didn't actually go to sleep. Then this is Alcafar, so you can actually walk there from Salgar, which is where we stayed. Oscar's first time in the sea and he loved it. I think he preferred it because he could actually move around and crawl and have a bit of control rather than being in a float. So you can see how happy he is. Then this is the walk down from the villa down into the centre of Salgar where we stayed and you can walk along this um, seafront. So we did that pretty much every evening. I feel like I'm meant to live next to the sea, I absolutely love it. And then this is one of the last days before we left. So you can see that he's starting to get really comfortable in the water and we actually ended up getting some armbands because we found that he just wanted the freedom to move. Whereas a float, he didn't really have much control. He was kind of just like bobbing around. Whereas here he's preferring to kick and move his arms. So he was way more comfortable. And 
And then this is on the way home. Again, somebody was able to move for us so we could pop him in the middle seat. iPad was an absolute savior because here he's exhausted because it was bedtime. Um, so he didn't sleep on the flight here. Um, and then we put him in his pajamas ready so he could fall asleep in the car, which he didn't, but <laughs> that was the plan. And that's it, our first family holiday. Thank you so much for watching guys and hopefully you enjoyed it and we will get better at making these. We go away again in at the end of August so I feel a little bit more prepared as to how much footage we need to film, how much um, I need to talk more when I'm actually out there and Lou's actually got a new camera on the way which will be more stable so it won't be so shaky but we wanted to show you a little snippet of our holiday especially because it's been our first holiday in so long and our first one as a family.